Alright, hey guys, Guppy here. Welcome back to another episode of Guppy's Builds. Whew. That was quick. Well, it was quick for me, anyway. Um, so today we're going to be doing some... Uh, well, I've got a couple of things I need to do and a couple of things I must do. So, um, I'm sorry it's been a while. I've been doing stuff, you know, the, uh, default stuff. Um, well, that's what I needed. <laughs> okay, cool. We got everything we need. Let's, uh, head out. So, um, got a couple of things planned. So, the first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a... Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, uh, the first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a mob farm. And, um, this is different from my uh, mob farm up here. Yeah, this is one I've made earlier. Me <laughs> made a while ago. It, decent drops. Um, decent drops. Although, the problem is that at night time, mobs run around. So, we're going to... We're gonna get something that I mean. I'm just gonna experiment around, so I'm not sure um, whether this will work or not. So don't take my word for it. Okay. Yeah. Um. God damn it! I've forgotten redstone, haven't I? And that was just a sound of a skeleton falling to his death. <laughs> Lovely days. Okay. Ooh, magma cream. Nope. Mm. No, nope. I, I do need a bow though. I have some arrows. I took some arrows just in case I would have a bow. Hmm, I'll take one of these as well. Redstone. Dispenser. Dispensers are cool. <laughs> um, I, I really don't know how this is going to work, and I'll, we'll take some signs just in case. We need some signs. We won't need signs actually. I don't know why the hell I picked those up. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm I'm gonna go and get the stuff I need, and I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Um, got that redstone. It was lovely, but um, I wanna I wanna show you guys how I make a piston. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm sure you've seen it before, but you know, it's there's always a little bit of magic involved. Kaboom! Oh yeah, pistons in the house. Ooh, I got an email. And now we've run out of wood, which sucks. Okay. Well, I don't want to waste all my iron, so... Let's take six. Uh, no. Yeah, a multiple of three. So, 25. Okay. That's not a multiple of three. Stupid Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft is awesome. Just kidding. Um, so, let's see. Ah, oh, come on. Are you kidding me? 26 pistons. That doesn't sound too good. So, um... <laughs> okay, let me go and check away this useless sh uh, shizzles. Okay. It's good enough for me. No, I, I need that. Right. And torches. Torches are always a good thing. Gunpowder coal. Anything useful. Anything useful. Oh, yeah, there is one more thing I need to craft. Because if you have pistons... You gotta have. All right. Um, I'll turn two of those into that, and we'll make two more pistons just in case. It's uh, it always pays to have a fair bit of pistons, obviously. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. Pistons ahoy! And I'll chuck this, the rest of this iron, into my stack of iron over there, which I could have just as well used anyway. So uh. I'm gonna make some levers, and we're ready to rumble. Whew. So, um, I'm gonna be building it over there. Uh, I'm gonna... Okay, I'm gonna have a look around, just find out... Ooh, this, this ocean is pretty flat. <laughs> I, I'd expect it to be a bit more ocean-like. But I'm gonna have a look for a... Sort of, if the ocean gets any bigger than this, and, um... I'm gonna swim. No point for a boat. Hello, Ocelot. Hello, do you drop fishes? No. <laughs> uh, it was kind of funny before, because you could kill them, and then you could take the fishes and tame their brethren. It's pretty awesome. Anyway, so I'm going to find a place to build my um, new mob spawner, and I'll be right back. Alright, um, a little change of plans. Let's uh, take a... Uh, come on, this way you could... This, you got to be kidding me. I swear you were allowed to place blocks. 
Oh, come on. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's see. Can I... Okay, I can place blocks underneath them. So, I can place... Okay, now, now I can do it. So, uh, let's let's just take an, uh, a look from above. And uh, we'll see my... Uh, my problems exactly so let's go up here all right so you see this this area is quite large in fact I, I'd say it's a very large indeed only problem is there's a big no no boo-boo in the middle of it so uh, instead of going off that way and making the next base really far away from this one oh that looks really nice actually really nice oh look there's a little cove <laughs> Never looked in there. Anyway, so uh, we're gonna just spend a little bit of time destroying that, and then we'll be uh, right back with your next episode. What? <laughs> no, just kidding. Uh, we're gonna do it in this episode, cause um, it's not too difficult. Will the? I swear, Cheb said he was gonna fix that. I swear. There's one thing I swear he said. Oh well, I'll just MC edit it back together. <laughs> Meaning, I don't, I don't use MC Edit to cheat, just to fix, just to fix water, because water, it's pretty goddamn annoying. All right, so I'm gonna go and uh, destroy this, and um, yeah, I'm gonna be right back. Alright, I'm back, and I've finished, and I've got to say, either they've changed water physics by a lot, or it never was that difficult, and I've been playing Minecraft for a while, so I'm pretty sure they've changed water physics, and they've changed it for the better, because usually this would, I expected this to take me, um, 20 minutes, because that's what it used to take, I see, I'm pretty sure that's how long it takes, but now all we got to do is remove this, and it's probably easier to do it while standing on it, because... Uh, you mine faster when you're not in the water. I don't have aqua infinity. My gear is all rubbish. Okay, so what? <laughs> right, so uh, let me do this and um, be right back. Boy, did I pick up a bunch of useless stuff. So uh, right, gonna put. All right, finished. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> and you you wouldn't you wouldn't even guess that there was ever an island apart from those blocks there. But <laughs> look, island and no island. You know my name is now officially Guppy the Island Destroyer. So uh, now what we gotta do is take out the useful stuff, throw away the useless. <laughs> I I really shouldn't have picked up this much stuff. Oh, no, come on, come on. We don't want the dirt. We don't want the oak. We don't want the sapling. We don't want that. We want this. We really shouldn't need that. We want that. Even though we won't need it, we don't need that really. And we need that. And we need that. So we don't need you. We don't need you. We don't need you. Um.
Alright, I think I fixed it. Anyway, now for part two of my, um, epic mob, power, mob farm. So, um, oh, I don't need one there. This, <laughs> okay, I shouldn't have done this, but, you know, meaning, because it makes a flipping annoying sound. Okay, F3, we don't need you anymore. Right, awesome. So, let's, if only I had something to test there, test it on. No, it'd be so, it'd be so much easier building stuff if you had the test subject. Test subjects are epic. Alright, so, um, what I meant by aggressive is, that one's a passive mobs, uh, mobs one, meaning basically it, it waits for the mobs to sort of essentially jump out into your lap and fall down of their own free will, and you know, I was like, that's cool, that's cool, but then I realized, why the hell should monsters have free will, you know, it just doesn't make any sense, monsters don't need free will. So we're gonna make it an aggressive one that forces them off. Woo! <laughs> All right. Um. So what we need is one, two, three, four. That's probably more redstone than we can account for. Yes, it is more redstone than we can account for. Right. That's probably enough. Okay. So uh, no, it is definitely not enough. We need more. We need tons more. Well, I'll go and get more in the br in the um in the break. In the moment when I go wait, wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You need um, you need redstone for this, don't you? Yeah, you do. Sucks. Well, I'll show you what I mean anyway. So, so redstone repeater here. So the moment someone steps on that, okay, and then one, two, transmits the current to a redstone torch. All right. Actually, one second, one second, wait a second, wait a second, Buster. All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, and then, and, okay, this is pretty dangerous. I don't, I don't want to be standing here. Well, I'll do that. Kaboom, and that is how it works. Why is it still on? Oh, no, I, I need to invert the signal, don't I? God damn it. Why do I forget these things? This thing's... Come on, that was close. <laughs> I was just really worried. I don't want to fall off. I don't want to fall off. Alright. Give me my piston. So, uh... That throws a hink in our chitinks. But that's uh, easily fixable. Oh, shoot. So, wait, wait, wait. Let me think. Let me think. Alright. So, it transmits power to... Oh, right. Okay, okay. That's cool. It's uh, pretty simply sold. It's just... Go like that. You got all of that. You get a little bit of a repeater going on here, and then you put a block here. And then. Okay, cool. And then when you press the button, it turns on. And then. You got yourself a. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, that's close. But, that's how it works. Look at that epicness. <laughs> so, that's how it works. Um, so, the mob stands on there, and they get pushed off. Um, the last one, yeah, so that's that's a good thing about this mob trap. Um, and the best thing is, um, I can even spawn, I can spawn Enderman in here. And um, I can't spawn spiders, because there isn't enough space, and secondly, spiders, uh, you'd need the pistons to be one down, and then you couldn't have the pressure plates in the first place. So spiders are much easier, at least. M much. Spiders are... You can spawn spiders much more easy. Easily, easily. You can spawn spiders much more easily. No, easily. You can spawn spiders easily by um, <coughs> using that that mobs. Uh, no, using um, a mob. Um, what am I talking about? Using one of those. Um, like, if I were to throw my shovel down here, because I don't need a shovel. Exactly. I could use stone press plates, but it's not like anything's gonna die around here unless some <laughs> some uh, skeletons have a, some sort of row or something. Right. And then. Right. Okay. And uh, this is pretty simple. Right. And this is this is array. This array finished. I just need some more repeaters for each one. See, as soon as I step on it, it's pretty nice. Okay. Cool. Um, so see, I do, I do, I do know my redstone a little bit, <laughs> a little bit, a little, 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 little bit, little, little bit. All right. So um, yeah. So it's a bit more. It's it's much more faster. I I hope it will be faster. We don't know until we've tried. 
Um, I, I think I think it's getting around time where I have to uh, end off this episode. So, um, the usual, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please rate, comment, subscribe for more videos like this one. And um, I hope to see you next episode because we'll be continuing this thing and we'll be finding out whether this thing actually works. But for now, I'll be making my leave. Woo! Shoot, no, 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 no. Oh, cool. One block. Saved my life. <laughs> okay. Well, that looks pretty epic. Look at that. That red, redstone looking. Oh, that's, that is so cool. Um, only problem I I could think of is that the the mob glitches as it spawns, so the piston pushes that in its face and it doesn't fall off. But hopefully that won't happen. Um, anyway, so um, yep, bye.